everyone, my name is Caleb and today I'm going to be discussing navigation menus. In this episode, I will be showing you how to make programmatic changes to your navigation menu to ensure it works on AMP. With that said, let's dive right in. If you have clicked on the link in the video description, you'll be taken to this page, which has examples of how you can make your mobile navigation menu work. For today's example, let's check out Make Programmatic Changes Using Nav Menu Toggle in the right side of the page. As you can see, you can add theme support for the AMP plugin using the Nav Menu Toggle flag. This will be the navigation container ID, which is where your mobile navigation menu is contained. This will be the navigation container toggle class, which is a class that shows and hides the navigation menu. This will be the menu button's ID, which is a hamburger button, menu, or any other button you have. And this will be the button's toggle class. Some hamburger menus have an animation that turns into a class when you click on it. You can change how that behaves here. In the menus section of the appearance tab on my dashboard, I have mobile navigation checked for this theme. On the settings page of the AMP tab, in the template mode section, I have transitional selected as my template mode so that I can differentiate between AMP and non-AMP versions. Here I have the non-AMP version of the theme open so I can observe its behavior, as well as the AMP version so I can observe its behavior simultaneously. As you can see, the hamburger menu isn't currently working on the AMP version. Let's fix that. Back on the document page, we're going to copy the entire bit of code and paste it into the themes functions.php file. Now we have to add inputs into these sections. In the non-AMP version, you can see that when I click on the hamburger menu, it just toggles open and close. Now when we inspect the menu, it gives us the menu button's ID. Double click the ID, copy it, then paste it into the theme's support code here. Now for the next bit of code. On the non-AMP version, if we toggle the hamburger menu open, you'll see that we have a new class called menu-open. This is the toggle class for this menu button, which turns the hamburger menu into a cross once clicked. I'm going to copy the menu-open class and paste it into the theme's support code for the menu button toggle class here. The next step will be inspecting the container for the menu on the non-AMP version. Inspecting carefully, you can see the menu container being highlighted. After selecting it, you will see the menu container code highlight. You'll notice it has VK Mobile Nav Open as the class and VK Mobile Nav as the ID. Copy the ID here and paste it into the themes nav container ID section. Next, we're going to be checking for a toggle class. So in the non-AMP version, if I close the menu container, some things change in the code. If I toggle it open again, you can see that VK Mobile Nav Open is here. Copy this class, then back in the theme support code, paste it into the nav container toggle class section. Save the changes, and that's it. If we go to the AMP version and reload the page, we can see that the hamburger menu is now working on AMP. If you'd like to learn more, visit the link in the description and explore the many topics there. I'm Caleb. Thanks for watching.